Hey you guys, it's Brian Paul standing here in VR as always, um, playing Trickster VR. I, I'm like super late to this party, man. Um, everyone else has played this game before me, uh, but that's okay. Um, you know, sometimes games get past us, and uh, and I happen to have a Saturday free, which is um, very, very, very unlike me. Uh, usually, I'm over at the restaurant. What is up, Taylor Gaming, Fortnite, Overwatch, and more? JD Max, the game cap. <laughs> All right, so this has an interesting control scheme. Let's try to get through this real quick here. Um, it does have a teleportation option. Oh, good. Oh, as long as you haven't played it, JD, I think we're all set. Um, what's up, Bed and Game Cats? So, uh, so for some reason, we're controlling Metcat. What up, dude? Uh, we're using the right move controller to move, walk around with. So it's traditional walking controls, meaning I'm holding the move button down. Also, let me know if the sound is okay. I turned it down. Uh, I, I turned it down quite a bit, um, but it still sounds really loud in my head. In my head, everything's loud. What's up, Kebgret? Uh, so, using the right move control, I'm holding the move button down, just kind of pointing to where I want to go. There are buttons, like the triangle, to walk me backwards, and that's kind of it. But it's the right move controller, which is a little strange for me. Uh, we got some weapons and stuff. We definitely love cats. We're a big fan of the game Cats um, over here. I guess, yeah, I like the look of this game. Uh, what's up, Woody the Bluebird? It's, uh, it's, it's like simple, but, but colorful. What's up, Rypop? Um, and I'm just so far, like, I'm really kind of feeling this, uh, even though I haven't done anything yet. So I, I've never played this game before. It's the very first time I even started it. Um, Sunday morning, Richard. Okay, you are somewhere else. <laughs> Metcat, no, this is single player, and I don't know if they're... Oops, oh, I accidentally teleported. Let's try that again. Um, I, I don't, I don't know if they're actually going to bring us the multiplayer, but I figured let's check out the single player in the meantime. It's not expensive. This is a pretty cheap game. I want to say like less than fifteen dollars. Uh, <laughs> I haven't heard any news from Paris Games Week yet, but we'll see. Guys, how is the audio? Is it sound okay? All right. So what do we do here? We got the campaign map. Do I have to put this away to to select things? In the UK, right on. All right, so let's select. Great oh. pick. That's my favorite vacation spot. Jesus, that was like. Hold on a second. <laughs> Where's my options screen? Here we go. I, I don't know how loud that was for you, but the NPC just screamed at me. Sounds good. 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 Everybody's happy with the sound. I'm very happy to hear that. Good. What up, Mousy? What up, everybody? All right, let's try this again. Oh, you're gonna love this. Why is that so loud? I don't know if it's loud for you, but man. You gotta love this. It was really loud in my head. Okay, peaceful bay. I guess we'll. That's what we're looking for. We are definitely looking for some casual difficulty. All right, let's get our weapons back up here, and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll throw this disc eventually here. All right, looks like we're doing okay. Everybody's good with the audio. It, it's going to take a little bit of time to uh, to get used to how this game controls. Because it's a little it's a little wonky here using the right move controller, but we'll get used to it. Let's do some casual difficulty. Whoa, there we go. Moving mountains of stone with a single thought. That's the arcane art of the keepers. What up, guy cannon? Find their groves and stop them from helping the horde with their powers. Follow the blue light. That is those are words to live by right there. Yeah, right. Transistor is not a PSVR game. I, I have I have played Transistor, uh, but but that was before my PSVR days for sure. What is up, Roy? How long do you think this load screen is? How many arrows can we shoot while we're waiting for the game to load? There's a chest oh. just ahead of you. Maybe worth checking out. Oh, the stories I'm going to tell about this. Why is this guy so loud? All right, find the crystal grove. Kill the reaper of the grove. I. I, I I think uh, I think this will be okay. Whoa, whoa! Right. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, let's kill. Ah, uh, <laughs> all right, all right. I didn't prepare for that. I didn't prepare for that. I wasn't I wasn't ready for 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 up close personal combat here. All right, we're, we're good. We can pick up all these weapons. Interesting, interesting. 
Uh. I know that smell. A smelly, smelly smell. There must be a chest nearby. Uh, chest smell, apparently. That's good to know. Very strange. <laughs> Alright, do I have to put it... Oh, I don't have to put weapons away. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, they just kind of throw this shit at you. Alright, cool. Uh, so do we just walk into it, or...? How do we pick this stuff up? Oh. What? What? <laughs> Hold on, I'll figure this out. No, no, no. I just want... Oh, okay. Just reach, reach out. Reach out and touch it. Alright, we're picking stuff up now. Now what about this over here? Do I have to reach down to the ground to pick this up? Alright, kind of. Alright. That was a lot of work to pick some shit up, man. Whoa, oh, oh. Okay, well, let's, just, let's just try this out real quick. Let's see what this looks like. Alright, I love the ricochet action. Just the tip, says Matt Cat. Alright. You think this is... I think I can take this gigantic... What's up, Nibble? Wow, game cat. I'm just exploring the outer reaches of the map here. This is a pretty nice looking game, I gotta say. Uh, it's not like... It's stupidly hard. Oh, and that's not what I was in the mood for. Yeah, Rich, I totally agree. I, like, at this point, if a game doesn't have... I mean, it, it, there there is a standard at this point for, for normal control normal control scheme. Uh oh, where are they? Where are they? I've got my headphones in. Yeah. That's oddly satisfying. Alright, whoop, whoop. see if we can get this guy around the corner here. Hey, this is pretty cool. It feels really good, I gotta say. Dude, <laughs> Uh, Asmir, you're learning with me, dude. Uh, so, so stick around, because this is, as the video says, this is my first impression of a game I've never played before. I, I should have played it like a month ago with everybody else, but, uh, but I, but I don't know anything about it other than what we're already figuring out. Uh, visuals are awesome, no frills. Uh, but surprisingly so. Yeah. Uh, really neat. Whoa, 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 there we go. Come on, come on. Can we walk and aim? We can totally walk and aim. Oh no, oh no. Hold on. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. Everything's everything's coming up in Millhouse. And the butt. Man, Metcat, you only got one thing in mind ever, don't you? It's like the same thing the rest of us have in mind. Alright. Yeah, it was, like I said, I was not in the mood for a really difficult game tonight. I guess I had no idea what I was getting into. But, so far, so good. Um, where is my... Do I have a health bar somewhere? Boom. I think it's a scroll kind of just, like, hanging out here. It, it, but it's... I feel like a, I feel like a puppy because I'm, like, chasing my tail trying to look at it. Scroll of fireball. All right, well, we'll grab that if we need it, I guess. I don't really know how the mechanics work. I feel like he's just doing some happy drummer shit right now. <laughs> I love that we're giving puppy training advice in the stream now. This is good. This is good. Everyone needs some advice sometimes. Uh, let's see where this bridge takes us. I heard these levels are procedurally generated. Uh... Bridges that could go nowhere might my, my lend to that theory. Let's let's find out. Can I jump? Hey, Jamie, what's happening, dude? Meow. Oh, so I can. I don't think I can jump. That doesn't seem to be a thing. No. And there's yeah another cliff that leads nowhere. Oh wait, what is this thing over here? This looks like it's, uh, it, maybe I'm standing on the wrong side of it. Let's maybe get over here. Here we go. Look at this. I don't know. I, I would really like some hands, to be honest with you. Okay. Hold to aim and reload. Well, there's no one to fire at. 
Can I use both hands? Yeah, I can use both hands. Alright. Ooh, ooh. I'm getting I'm getting a feeling that we need to knock something down here. Like uh <laughs> Huh. I like this. This feels really good. But But I'm getting the distinct impression I'm supposed to be doing something. Oh, they told me to follow the blue light. So you know what? We'll come back to this thing. Let's go follow the blue light. Uh-oh. We seem to be stuck on a rock. We can do it. We can do it. Ain't no stopping a game cat. Puppy pads. Oh, God. I'm going to have nightmares about puppy pads. When I lived in Tennessee, I had a puppy for a short amount of time. Uh, this cute little rat terrier. And, uh... Hey, where'd my sound go? Can you guys... Did my sound cut out? Well, let, me, let me find out if that's my headphones or if that's the game. Uh, you guys let me know if the sound cut out because I hear nothing right now. I hear nothing. I hear nothing. No sound. You guys hear sound? I hear no sound. Oh, I got sound back. That's really strange. Maybe my headphones just totally... I got really crappy headphones in right now. They're like just like the little earbuds. Eric Higgins hears all. <laughs> Alright, good to know, good to know. Very strange. My, my headphones just... Here's the crystal grove. Jesus Christ. If you find the keeper, don't shoot him in the back. That's why he's the toughest. Oh, oh, hey. There we go, come on. Oh, 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 we're in trouble. Move, move, move. Oh, no. I'm not supposed to hit him in the back. No! Oh, no! No! Hold on, switch weapons! There we go. Yeah, move forward, move forward. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh no, this isn't, this isn't going well. Okay, okay, wait, am I still alive? I'm still alive? Alright, good, good, still alive. I hope, hopefully I'm recovering slowly here. Alright, good, good, good. Looks like I'm recovering health. Slowly, slowly, we're getting him. Come on, come on. <laughs> Alright, so the question is, is did I just use a life? What's up, Armuki? So I don't, I don't know if I just used a life. Like everything went red, but does, was I recovering my health or did I actually use a life? Um, is there some, some kind of option screen here that tells me? Let's see here. A lot of stuff to unlock, I like this. You faint three times if you die. I don't think that helped me. I was recovering, good to know, good to know. Thank you guys, all right. Can I... Can I fuck with the crystals? <laughs> Let's fuck with crystals! Alright. Emerald City can go fuck itself. Alright, what are we doing? Oh. I guess we're going down there. We gotta follow the blue light. Do 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 Following the blue light. Come on. What kind of game... Doesn't let you destroy barrels. Destroying barrels is like half the fun. Ooh, look, I have a shadow down there. Uh, I guess we'll just cut to the chase here. There's a looping sound effect. Uh oh, let's switch, let's switch. 
<laughs> no, Jason. Go Gollum did not come out. Or Golem? I can't remember. Is it Golem or Gollum? I would say the wrong thing, and then I'd have to correct myself. Don't be an easy target. Don't be an easy target. Aim for that big head. Uh, Jay, this is this is a pretty cheap game. This is under fifteen dollars. I forget exactly how much it costs now. Uh, but it's uh, it's, but so far it's pretty good. It's I feel like it's I'm already getting my money's worth. Although uh, I don't think I bought this one. I'm pretty sure the developer sent it to me, which I always feel bad about, man. Sometimes like a game gets past you, and you're like, all right. You're like, I swear I'm going to review your game, and then like three months go by, and they're like, hey, uh, you ever going to review our game? And I'm like, fuck. Uh, that happened with the 2MD VR football guys. I always I felt really bad about that one. Uh, but I'm determined to not let too many of these get past me. Oh, oh. <laughs> nice headshot. Side shot. <laughs> Butt shot. All right, we got a lot of shots in. Everybody, take shots. Shots, shots, shots. All right, what do we got here? Yeah, it's 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 super simple, right? And, I, and actually, when I when I started this up, I was like, uh, in in the in a world that uh, in a world where we live with Skyrim VR, like, is this is this necessary? Um, especially without the multiplayer. Now the easy part: tap the room and wait for the portal to charge up. And that guy. I wish I could. T for some reason, for some reason, the, the 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 volume of his voice is not affected by the NPC voice option. I'm pretty sure orcs are hitting a chest nearby. Want to check it out? <laughs> wow! Can't wait for you to try this one. That's awesome, Grant. Now we just need a. Oh, no, I'll, I will keep the scroll of fireball. <laughs> um, yeah, Gran Turismo at 20 bucks is obviously a much better price. Now they just, I mean, they really, really, really just need to, to hook it up with like a full full grid of racers. All right, wake the portal. Charging portal, whoa. Oh, 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 hey, that was cool. Ah, ah. Ah, cool. All right, keep moving, keep moving. Who else is? That was, that was it. All right, see, this is. Whoa, whoa, whoa! This isn't totally new. This is. Shoot, shoot, shoot! There's lots of them. Ah. Oh crap! Here, switch, 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 switch weapons. All right, keep moving, keep moving. Here we go. All right, let's. We gotta recover real quick here. Uh, so this uh, this came out like a month ago, I think. I I I, I don't know the exact date. <laughs> Jeez, they're everywhere. Hold on. I'm moving. Jesus. Oh, all right. Man, I don't. I think that's probably going to be an that endless way of venom. pretty good, actually. They're even uglier from up close, aren't they? I wonder they get so angry all the time. Oh, I didn't do any healing. I guess I probably should figure out how to do that. Uh, looks like we got some uh, new weapons here. Crossbows. Yeah, Jay, uh, you're not kidding, man. Uh, this is this is actually a whole lot of fun. Um, Sierra, it also depends where you are. Don't forget, like a lot of games don't come to like the UK or Australia like right away. Uh, sometimes it's uh, sometimes it takes a little time uh, for especially smaller developers to get their games to other regions. I have a feeling this one's out everywhere, but I don't really know to be honest. Uh, so anyway, uh, let's see. So we got we got a new weapon, which is cool. Very. Oh, oh, we do have, uh... Okay, so just twist to the side to reload. We do have limited ammo, though, so I shouldn't... Oh, and I have two of them. I, <laughs> I did not even notice that in my left hand I had another one. This is so great. All right, These, this is what I want. I want I want the crossbows, and I want my sword and shield, uh, and I'm good to go. So, oh. What's up, dude? That 
quite the real thing, but good practice. All right. Moving on, moving on, we're moving on. Yeah, this is this definitely has uh, this definitely had some uh, some appeal to it. Uh, like I said, in a world of, where we live with Skyrim VR, I had no idea that this was going to be even necessary. Ah, uh, some of Game Cat. I'm really sorry to hear that. All right, let's figure out what where our next. Yo, let me recenter the camera real quick. There we go. Let's figure out where we're going next here. Um. Still getting used to this. I thought I had to select it. No, it just is it just automatically. <laughs> That's the other thing, JD. JD, you're totally on. You're totally. You're totally on it, man. Like everybody, everybody's talking about how. What's up, buddy? Bobby Game Cat X. Everyone's uh, everyone's talking about how they can't play Home Sweet Home because they don't live in North America. Um, just make a North American account. It's really it's really easy. Um, just buy some buy some gift cards on G2A.com, uh, you're, you're, and then you'll be good to go. What's up, Lethal Weasel VR? Oh, wait, wait, hold on a second. I totally missed that we can get some upgrades. How'd I miss that? We'll hit start, and we'll check our... Check our upgrades. Here we go. Uh, so we can do more damage. That's the only thing that seems to be unlocked. Like, I want to select it, but it's not doing anything. Oh, uh, wait, hold on. Oh, I've got 91 gold, and it requires 150. So just because it's unlocked doesn't mean you can actually uh, upgrade. All right, cool. Good to know, good to know. We're learning as we go. Yeah, Jay's on top of it. All right. Remember, orcs heads make great target practice. Nope. Show me some skills. <laughs> I, love the, I love the chat being delayed. He's right, off to go. love some of your diplomatic solutions. So I guess off to Mournful Guardian. We're still on casual difficulty. I'm enjoying that. The Black Iron Forges work mercilessly to outfit the horde with impervious armor. It's time to fight fire. Follow the blue light. I think I can handle it. Metcat lives in Texas. That's good, man. That's good. That's that's what we call a we call a safe distance. <laughs> uh, Roy, yeah. So far, this seems to be uh, totally seems to be worth the money. Uh, hey, I think I've seen a chest somewhere around here. All right, so let's go How about for a trying some new toys whoa, this whoa. time. Don't be boring. Ah, ah! Forgot to reload. <laughs> let's keep moving. Reload, reload. Come on, where are you going? Get back here. Alright. That could have gone better, but it could have gone much, much worse. up all sorts of good stuff here. Alright. More arrows. Alright, doing okay. Uh oh, uh oh. Careful. Here they come. Oh, pardon me. There we go. Meow. Meow. Alright. All right, that went much, much better than uh, than expected. Now let's reload and let's get a move on. Now hold on a second. What was it? What was up with this? What do I have here? Scroll of fireball. I still haven't used the scroll. Yeah, we can we can leave that there. Oh. Jesus. 
All sorts of shit flying out here. Alright. Yeah, I can't believe I let this one get past me. I, I really, really hate that uh, when, it, when a game that's actually good, uh, like I totally ignore it because I don't have time to play it. Like the fact that when I when I started this up tonight, I was like, <laughs> I had to check for for updates. I had to I had to make sure that like it was actually move compatible. Like I had to had to really double check what I was playing because I hadn't ever started it before. Um, so this is this is all new to me, and I'm really really happy I finally got around to playing it. So much loot, so much loot. Never a bad thing. <laughs> What's up, Tommy Cat and VR Hat? Um. I, you know, I, I don't actually know who makes Good this. News for you. There's a fat chest laying around just waiting to be looted. Now this can save your butt in a pinch. Scroll of Meteor. Whew. I think we'll take Meteor over Fireball. I don't know. Alright, I think that's everything, yeah? Alright. Oh, God. I felt bad even right. I felt bad while I was writing the Heavy Fire review. Like, I understand that, like, I've got to be honest about how bad a game is, but Jesus, like, you know, Mastiff, Mastiff is, like, they seem to be new to the whole PSVR um, world, I guess, you know, because they just put out Home Sweet Home, but they published Home Sweet Home. They didn't develop it. Um, but then Heavy Fire is like, damn, you guys, you guys followed up. That's the Iron Forge. Keep your wits about you. The Forge Master must be around. Keep you your distance and wait for an opening in his defenses. All right, we'll keep our distance and wait for an opening in his defenses. But anyway, so I just I just felt bad. Uh, no, no, nothing's worse than thug life. But like, but, but like, but there's no need for. No need for heavy fire to be thirty dollars. It's insane. I don't know who Chris is, but Chris is insane. All right, let's see. Can we get this guy from the back? Yep, we can. Whoa, 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 whoa! What is it? We're, uh, we're in big trouble. Yeah, big trouble. Keep, moving. Keep moving. What's up, that guy's will? No, no mercy. Got something to warm you up under the fire. I got something to warm you up. All right. Yeah, I think we gotta switch weapons here. Oh crap! All right, we're just running away. We're just running away. All right, turn around. Turn around. Turn around. All right, everything's fine. The might hunger. No! Okay, let's get switch weapons. Warm welcome. I'm, st I'm stuck on a rock. Totally stuck on a rock. No, no, no! Oh God! Here. Flames, no, no mercy. We, we gotta move, man. We gotta move. We gotta, we gotta recover real quickly here. No. All right, let's see here. Let's switch weapons real quick. Okay, keep moving. Whoa! We keep moving, keep moving. God, I'm begging for like a normal control scheme right now. Under the Flames, no, no mercy. Here, the iron sing. Gonna keep your whoa, whoa! Almost fell off this bridge. <laughs> Flames, no, no. no. All right, I forget. You can double tap the move button to uh, to move to, to kind of teleport, move a little bit faster. I don't, I don't think so. Check this out. Nothing happens in the barrel. Metcat, take it easy, dude. Have an awesome night. Here, let's see if we can hit this guy from afar. I don't want to waste all my ammo in a. I have, I have no idea, Jay. This could be a regular enemy. I have no idea. Tommy, we honestly don't know. Uh, obviously, we'd love if this game would get the multiplayer of the PC version, um, but we don't have. I don't think we have any promises yet. I have a feeling they didn't expect me to take this long to beat him. <laughs> they only wrote like three lines of dialogue. They're like, oh, it's not going to take that long for anyone to beat him. They never met me before. Hey, where are you going? Uh-oh. 
There we go. Excellent work. I'm fixing up a portal back home for you. Just follow the blue light. Yeah, I gotta be honest, I, I, I thought that I was gonna just do a let's play of this game, uh, play it for an hour or two, and then be, and then be done with it. Um, but, but man, I'm really, really enjoying this, to answer McConnor's question. Um, it is it's awesome. It's awesome, it feels really good, uh, it's, it's obviously very appropriately priced, it looks great, it feels great, and, uh, and this, this definitely deserves, m like, a, a, enough time to, to get, to do a Wanna full go treasure hunting? There's an old chest right ahead. To do a full review for sure. Scroll fort. I haven't. I've never used a scroll. I got. I got to learn how to use the scrolls. Right. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, how's it going? There we go. One down. I love this whole like dodging or like just kind of hiding behind like the pillars and stuff. Just like. A natural cover system, it just feels so natural in VR to just be like, okay, here I am. Get out. Nope. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah. Uh, Alright, so what do you guys say? Let's, let's, you guys want to use a scroll just for the fuck of it and like see how it works? Oh, this is scroll of meteor. Do I have to throw it or do I just let it go? Let's find out. I'm going to throw it. Uh, whoa! There we go. Alright. Oh, whoa, oh, no! I was just about to pick up the scroll of force and it disappeared. Oh, now I got no scrolls. Who's got no scrolls? I got no scrolls. Alright, but I do have some arrows. Scatter shot. Yeah, I agree, Tangem. Like, I, I never, never, never liked uh, any cover based shooter. Uh, but in VR, man, it's like when you're act when you're the one taking cover, when you don't have to push a button to pop in and out of cover. Uh, you know, although I love Time Crisis. Uh, other than that, you found it. Look for the control room and give it a little tap. Ooh, scroll of Dragon's Breath. That sounds exciting. XP. Got more arrows. Oh, I'm I'm feeling well equipped right now. Yeah, I said it. Very well equipped. Alright, let's wake the portal. Tap, tap. Tap, tap. Uh-oh. He does not look happy. You're a force of nature! I love, I love when the environment moves like that, man. That is so cool. Home Sweet Home is like one of my favorite horror games. Oh, who's behind me? Somebody's behind me. Hey guys. All right. New skull to drink from. Oof, that's intense. All right, let's go pick some shit up. All right. She's still charging the portal. God damn. Oh, oh, hey, look at this. Oh, what's? Can we use this? Our way out is here. Uh, no. We're, we're moving, we're moving. Portal time. All right. Whew. Yeah. You still impress me sometimes. They're even uglier from up close, aren't they? No wonder they get so angry all the time. All right, guys. All right. I'm I'm loving this game right now. This is this is infinitely better than I thought it was going to be. I had heard so many horrible things about the control scheme and how. Uh, uh, Tommy, I'm I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play. God, I don't know what time is it. It's only eight o'clock here, so uh, so I think I'm gonna play for like the rest of the night. <laughs> I, I might I might play for at least another hour, maybe another two. We'll see what happens. Uh, all right, let's let's do some upgrading. We can finally up, upgrade our damage, so we're gonna up our damage by twenty percent. Yeah, that's that's some power right there. Um, but that's for melee attacks. Oh damn, I'm. Oh, for my ranged attacks. Oh no, we need more money. I didn't think this through. There's so much to upgrade. I'm so excited. All right, this is going to be great. But I don't have any more money. What do I have? I have 138. So we're really, really close to getting some ranged attack upgrades. Uh, dude, I, I love, love, love upgrading abilities. It's like one of my favorite things. 
Uh, Tantrum, I don't know. I know it's less than 15 bucks, but Jay Dow just bought it, so maybe he can tell you. Um, let's, uh, let's check out the Highlands here. Okay. I wouldn't do it any other way. Let's see. Looks like we have some options, too. We already did Peaceful Babe. We did Mournful Guardian just now. So we can do Cloudy Islands or Sunset Pass. Sunset Pass sounds nice. Here, let's go there. Wait, wait, wait. Brave difficulty. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not that brave. Casual. We're going casual. All right. I'd heard so many bad things about the, the control Iron scheme. Forges work mercilessly to outfit the horde with impervious armor. It's time to fight fire with fire. Fifteen bucks. Okay, so it's less than fifteen dollars, but only by a penny. Although once you pay some taxes, it's slightly more than fifteen bucks. I don't know why I thought this was like twelve or thirteen or something. Maybe that's how much it is on Steam. Uh, but what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? This is like I really want some happy drummer shit right now. I, I want I want to play happy drummer with this music. Oh no! I can't fall off the edge. <laughs> There we go, there we go. I want a new There we go, that's some that's some twenty percent extra attack power right there. Alright. What else we got? What else we got? We got some more gold over here. Yeah, there's there's uh there's there's definitely tax on digital in certain states. I don't think it's every state. Um but yeah, they, they really found a way to screw everybody over. Um, yeah, so it, well, what, what they're saying is, uh, is is that the frame rate dropped by like a couple frames a second occasionally, um, and so they had to remove multiplayer to get it to get it to pass Sony certification. Um, so hopefully they're not far from patching it back in. I'm getting it fixed up. I've got my own tricks to show of my I'm gonna cut you in half. I'm gonna cut you in half. I need a new skull to drink blood from. Wait, where's that guy coming from? Oh. Cowards! Like I get that Sony, I get that Sony's like got some pretty severe quality control going on, um, but yeah, they they need to loosen up a little bit. They're so concerned about motion sickness that like they're they're trying to, they're just kind of like ruining things in the process. You know, when we had when the Exorcist launched and it had to like force blinders, I was like, come on, seriously? You know, and, and the developers are saying, oh, Sony won't let us turn them off. It's like, well, how come some people have them on, some people don't? How come some people it's optional? How come some it's not? Um, yeah, exactly. Well, so it's like. It, 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 but it wasn't it wasn't like a severe frame rate problem. It was like a couple frames or something here and there. Um, so it's it's yeah. Well, I, I think I think Sony's got their own set of issues. Sure have hidden a chest nearby. Wanna check it out? Um, you know, so Sony's got these like Spider-Man VR experiences. Uh, they're turning people off from VR all by themselves. That's the Iron Forge. Whoa, whoa. Keep your wits about you. The Forge Master must be around. Ah, ah. Keep your distance and wait for an opening in his defenses. Under the fire. Ah. <laughs> the iron move, move, move. There we go. Come on, come on, Under keep moving. The fire, the stone tracks. Got something to warn you. So we can get him from afar here. I really should have upgraded these instead of my melee attack. Whoa! Move! 
Whoa! Oh, he got me good. He got me real good. I right, turn around, turn around. Whoa, 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 move back! Oh, that hurt. Oh, no, 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 no! No! I'm out of ammo. Oh, I have a scatter shot. Does, does that use ammo? <laughs> yeah, we better switch. Alright, we're gonna have to get a couple good shots in without getting hurt. Oh, let's, let's use our uh, charge attack here. Oh, fuck. Where'd he go? It's way up there. Hey, maybe there's a chest around here while I'm waiting for him to come back. No chest, no chest. No chest, no chest. Necesito un chest. Oh, hey, found a chest. <laughs> Okay, take some of that. Uh, what is this? Scroll of Thunder. What do we have? Do we have a scroll? We do have a scroll. Oh, crap, we have a scroll. We should be using a scroll. What is that? I didn't even know what that was, but apparently it's a bunch of coins. All right, so we're going to leave the scroll there. We're going to use this scroll real quick. Where's the dude? Where's the dude? There he is. All right, here we go. Ready? Get him. Oh, no. That's pretty cool, but I don't think he's close enough. Ah! All right, to get this girl. I wonder how you're going to use that. Something epic, I hope. Here, the iron sing. I can't quite get him from here. Come on, come on, come on! So close. There we go. Wonderful. All right. I've marked your exit with a huge blue light. You won't miss it, will you? That was pretty epic. Alright, just fixing the headset a little bit here. Where is the huge blue light that we're not gonna miss? It's like a Beavis and Butthead episode. This music's awesome. I, this game has such a cool art style. Wanna go treasure hunting? There's an old chest right ahead. What's up, Retro Gamer? Whoa. Here they come, here they come. Oh, there's a lot of them too. Here. Oh, you guys just gonna run right past me? Is that what's happening? Got him. I don't, I mean, I don't mind if you run right past me, that's totally fine. Alright, here, you know, let's, let's see if that works again. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Come on, come on! Brutal! I don't honestly know, like, I mean, obviously I'm killing them with my sword, but there, there's definitely... I gotta, I gotta watch the health bar. I gotta watch their health bar when I'm attacking them, because it doesn't feel like each hit is doing what I want it to do. Alright, so we get the scroll of thunder. What do we got here? I'll keep the scroll of meteor. That's fine. Right, there's a dude over there. He looks pretty pissed off. I want uh, a new skull to drink from. He, yeah, he, he, these guys all want skulls. Apparently skulls are like... Do I have a big head? Do I do I have a big head? Is that what they're, they're trying? They want my skull because I have a big head? Maybe they sent the wrong warrior in, man. Maybe we should have found someone with a smaller head. They wouldn't be so aggressive with them. That doesn't look right. I feel I feel like maybe something's. Oh, there we go. Hmm. All right, fine. We'll switch weapons. I should go pick up those arrows. Can I drop down? I can't drop down, but I can teleport down. Ah, <laughs> yes. This game kind of lets me do whatever the fuck I want, which is great, man. That's that was definitely the goal here. Right, and I gotta say, I'm getting really, really used to the uh, the control scheme.
There you go. Yeah, there's gotta be a chest around here somewhere. I've never heard anything differently the Down the easy part. Tap the rune and wait for the portal to charge up. Alright. I think I think we've discovered the gameplay loop. Oh, look at all this look at all of this ammo. This is fantastic. So many arrows. So little time. Alright, let's get let's tap tap tapity. Oh I'm oh I'm standing. Jay, any game that you're supposed to be, any any game where your character is standing, I'm generally standing. Jesus. Fuck. Move, move. Alright, we're moving, we're moving. Aim for that big head. Right, I'm just gonna break here real quick. 66 ammo. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Ah! 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 Move, move, move! <laughs> move! Use the scroll. Oh, yeah, I can totally use the scroll. Oh, no, where's the scroll? Get the scroll. Crap! I fainted. Right. Alright, well, I guess that's a. The portal is ready! Hurry up to it! Alright. Well, not my best showing. But let's see if we can just run right by all these guys. Here we go. Woo! Alright. There we go. Excellent work. Alright, it's a little stressful. I I'm I'm a little bit talking progress. I'm I'm a little bit irritated that I died when like I was like seconds away from leaving that level. Uh I'm wondering Hey, what's up, Dylan? Uh, looks like we got some new swords, which is kind of cool. That is that is very cool. All right. Uh, and whoever asked, um, I uh, yeah, the game came out like it came out like a month ago yet, a uh, month ago, and uh, they have not added co-op yet. But I figured I had to check it out. It's been uh, I've been it's just been sitting on my PlayStation Four since since the game launched, and I never even started it. Um, so I, I felt oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, so, so I figured it was about time I had a random, random Saturday off. So, uh, so that's it. Let's check. Let's check our ranged attacks here. All right, how much money? We got three hundred. Oh wow, this stuff. Get, this shit gets expensive really fast. All right, so we definitely want to upgrade our damage. And that's all we can really do with the range stuff. So I guess we have to have something equipped to upgrade it, I guess. Alright. Wait. What is, what is going on? We totally upgraded this already. We totally upgraded our melee damage. When, do, do we lose? Do we lose shit when we die? But you can't lose upgrades when you die. Or, it, it's from the equipped weapon. Oh no! You're kidding me. So hold on a second. Let's go find the. Uh, so, so this is the weapon we upgraded, right? All right. So here's our. Yeah, there you go. Justin knows what's up. All right, so and here it is. Holy crap! This is this is way. I thought I was, for some reason I thought I was upgrading my my character, um, you know my my character's abilities. But no, it, it is actually the wet the the weapons you're holding. That is insanity. Can I, I want to pick this up. There we go. It does. You know, it definitely does. Like I'm. 
I think I think if I knew going into it what I was doing, I wouldn't have upgraded anything. I would have waited until I started getting in some serious trouble, and uh, and then and then I would have done it. And I would started upgrading then, because these right now are my favorite things. Um, even though I haven't even used scatter shot yet, I guess I guess I got to try that in the next level. Let's check this out here. Send my regards to Uncle Orc, will you? Whoa. These levels, uh, these levels are definitely pretty big, man. Brave difficulty, we're going back. Be back quick. I'll get lonely, yeah? Alright, I guess we're doing Sunset Pass. Uh, here we go. So this will be our Somewhere first. Somewhere in these lands, an old library is hidden. It houses ancient scrolls that describe rituals orcs use to create their portals. I guess some things better be forgotten. I guess we're. Uh... I guess we'll finally do a level. Frying pan is a pun weapon. Huh. Um. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see how uh, how different Brave Difficulty is. I have no idea if this is going to be like super difficult or uh, or just slightly more difficult. I don't know what the level difficulty scale is, so we'll find out. We'll find out together. What? Did I tell you that story oh, when geez. I danced at an old wedding? All right, Jesus. Find the old library. We need to burn six bookshelves. What we need. Can I walk through that? I guess so. Whoa, whoa, who's. <laughs> yeah, Dylan and I have the same problem, man. I'm definitely like, oh, new VR game? Sweet! <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta play it, even if, it's, even if it's not getting good reviews. Uh, luckily, I'm one of the guys making the reviews, so uh, I, guess, I guess that kind of works in my favor. I could have used that. That would have been nice. Minimum wage is fourteen dollars. Jesus Christ. That is not. That is not the deal here in Massachusetts. Whoa! Whoa! Uh, this is definitely going to be more difficult. Crap, we gotta move. Hey, what's going on from China? Aim for the knees, go ahead, aim for the knees. I'm just a floating head. Some insanity going on here. Shoot. Alright, alright. We gotta move. We gotta move. Just getting out of control. Alright, we'll just leave them all hey, behind us. I think I've seen a chest somewhere around here. Yeah, where's the wanna chest? Go treasure hunting? Not really, I just wanna get a chest right ahead. <laughs> there we go. Come on, come on, come on. On, come on, come on. There we go. Move. Oh man, they're everywhere. They're everywhere. Hey, boy. <laughs> Wanna go treasure hunting? There's an old chest right ahead. <laughs> Whoa, whoa! <laughs> I 
I'm just, I'm just really hoping they recover by running away. It's getting real intense real fast. There we go. I'm slightly recovered, I think. Oh no! Okay, keep moving, keep moving. Woo! Holy crap! This took down like a whole pile of them. I want a new to drink from. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> Holy shit! Like I don't know the most effective way to uh, to take down a group of enemies like that. I don't know if I'm supposed to be swinging slowly and just like methodically. I'm just I'm just sitting here going <laughs> as fast as possible. Um, and it worked, so, so, woohoo! Yo, I haven't had White Castle in forever. Who said White Castle? Now I'm hungry. Oh, here we go. Here's the rest of them. There we go. Whew! Oh, oh, hey, look at that. Let's go get this guy over here, real quick. Nice, nice. This is fantastic. We are all stocked up on ammo. I am practicing for Beast Saver, man. What's a White Castle? That's insanity. I mean, there's even a movie about it. Harold and Kumar go to White Castle. I say we don't even answer the question. I say you just let him watch the movie. His mind will explode. It'll be crazy. What's up, Rob? How you doing, dude? Alright, at some point... At some point... They told me that there was a chest around here, so we gotta find that chest. Thank you, Rob. I appreciate that. It was funny, I was at work last night, I was at uh, the restaurant, and my manager was like, are you sure you don't want to work tomorrow? And I was like, wait, I have tomorrow off? <laughs> like, I had just taken a random Saturday off, like, and, and the reason for it was because, like, like sometime late last month, I was like, man, I gotta take a Saturday off close to Halloween just to make sure, in case I don't go to all the haunted houses and I'll do all the things I want to do for Halloween. Like, I get, this is like my last... My last hurrah, my last minute to, to be like, okay, well, here's a random Saturday night. Uh, I got to make sure I go see, every, go go to every scary movie that's out in the theater, and I, or go to uh, every haunted house that's available for me to go to. And I got to tell you guys that, like, man, I am I've fucking done it up this year. Like, it's it's we're not it's not even Halloween yet, and I have like done every scary thing I want to do. Um, so I'm like, so I was like, no, I, I don't want to work, even though I'm broke. Uh, but but I do uh, but I do want to keep my my day off and, and, and do some without parole stuff. Um, so I'm happy you guys could all, uh, uh, the Halloween movie was okay. Like, uh, as far as movies go, Halloween, the new Halloween movie was good. Um, but I actually, I gotta say, I preferred, what was it called? Hellfest? Hellfest was a lot of fun. Hellfest was just basically a slasher movie. Wait, finish quest to continue. Shit. There's a quest. Let's, let's check the quest. Find the old library. Okay, well, I guess we got I guess we ran past it when we were when we were scared. There we go. Can we just teleport down there? Yeah, maybe a little too high. Yeah. All right, so the, the downside, of course, being is that you know I, I got I got the uh, <laughs> I get the heavy fire review done, and I did that break. I finished up that breaking news report at like four o'clock in the morning. But Hellfest, dude, Hellfest is so much fun. Like it's not terribly scary, but it is awesome. It is, it is just a fun movie to watch. 
Ooh, there's some, there's some, there's some love going on here in the chat. <laughs> Yes, home sweet home, man. Home sweet home. Uh, Jer Jeremy's Jeremy King said he's he might do a stream of home sweet home for Halloween. So we will see how that goes if he actually does it or not. Hmm, it's an excellent question. I don't know. I saw the nun. I saw Hellfest. I saw Halloween. Um, I, I mean, I think I think Hellfest so just because it was so much fun to watch. It had it had a couple good jump scares and. Uh, and it was just a cool slasher movie. It was cool to see a new slasher movie, you know, in, in an age that we don't really get, like a new Friday the 13th ever, a new Nightmare on Elm Street ever. Uh, you know, I think I think Hellfest was a was a great return to form uh, for, for the genre. All right, where the fuck is this library? <laughs> Did anybody see a library? So is Mandy scary? I didn't think Mandy was supposed to be scary. I, I know it's made by uh, Spectrovision, but I, I, but I haven't seen it. I, I do want to see Mandy, uh, and but the fact that I can stream it is awesome. Oh yeah, dude, why do I keep forgetting about that goddamn beam of light? <laughs> oh hey, I don't see a beam of light. There it is. I just have no sense of direction, even when there's a giant beam of light telling me where to go. I'm like, where am I supposed to go? Oh, there we go. We found some enemies. We found that man. I want that fireball ability. Whoa! Hey! Give him water, whoa! Whoa! Car, boys. Just aim for that big head. Hey, you know what? I'm gonna try to save my. Whoa! Whoa! He's got a little familiar up there. What the hell? That is cool. That is so cool! Alright, here, let's, let's heal up a little bit before we come back and try again. What's up, Berber Cat? Alright, it's gonna take a second to heal up here. We're gonna come down the stairs. I'm gonna be ready for them when they come down the stairs. Come on, come on! I'm waiting for you. Hey! Oh, Jesus. I didn't expect it to be him. Dylan, take it easy, dude. Enjoy Home Sweet Home. Do I have to kill him? <laughs> I just kind of swung at both of them. Let's take his money. Take the money and run. Take the money and run. Can't decapitate him. <laughs> Wipe zone. Gotta go. Take it easy, Ripe Up. Ooh, I think I just blocked that with my. I want a new skull to. There we go. One down. More one, one another one. Dum -bum, dum -bum. Hey, was that a chest? What, what? I'm pretty sure I just saw a chest. Yeah. Right there in front of you. Uh huh. You don't give me time to get it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Everything's good. Yeah. There we go. Got this one. There we go. Nice, nice. And our heroes arrived at the scavenged library. Look around. Oh. 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 Burn them all. Yeah, this game gets better by the second. I love this game. Alright, let's, uh, let's go search. Uh, scroll Dragon Breath. Uh, what do we have here? Scroll of fireball. That dragon breath is better than fireball. All right, all right here we go. All right, let's search over here. Scroll of meteor. Well, I don't know. Let's get a right, search here. Scroll of fireball. It's got a lot of scrolls of fireballs. I was gonna... Okay, yep. Scroll of dragon breath. What dragon breath? Oh, you got a dragon breath. Yeah. All right. <laughs> These orcs have no idea what's coming for them. Neat! Why don't you shove it into an orc's face and Whoa. see what it does? What makes a man soil himself? You're in the front row. Come back here. I'm not done teaching. Let me teach you 
of manners. Knowledge will understand if I wanted to give a lecture about the man soil. Right through the wall, that's no good. Front row. 14! Oh no! Level 14! No! <laughs> Alright. Jesus. Jesus, this isn't going well. Whoa, whoa. Wow. I was doing okay for such a long time, and then bam. Alright, alright, alright. It's okay. It's alright. We got it. We got it. We got it. It's totally cool. That's bullshit. It shouldn't go through the wall. Alright, we need to get some distance here. This is an issue. Yeah, Trickster is definitely a should we. This is an awesome game for sure. Shit, shit, move. Alright, this is a much better way to go about this. I have an arrow sticking into me. Whoa. Holy crap. Oh, crap. These guys are getting really powerful really fast. Nice. Come on, duck under that. There we go. 14. Level 14 is not going to be easy. Come on. We gotta keep moving. Shit. Over the bridge. Over the bridge. Go, go, go. I'm not done. Holy crap! Yeah, nice. oh. And this and this is so much. It, it feels like so much more than hack and slash, uh, even though it's kind of not, I guess. Yeah, that is not doing much at all. All right. Oh hey, a treasure chest. Oh no! Can I go down there? Come on! I'm screwed. <laughs> I guess we'll open this since we're stuck here. Okay, we gotta move, we gotta move, we gotta move, come on! Don't wanna die! Come on, come on. You're a force of nature! Oh, alright. I've lost count. No more scrolls. I wanted to give a lecture about what makes a man soil himself. Shit. You're in the front row. Oh, these guys are like they're talking about. I'm not done. Just talking about using my skull drink out of it and then they're like I wanted to give a lecture Need to take my time here. Just need to take my time and get some distance, and I think we'll be okay. <laughs> he just wants to teach me a lesson. I think everybody wants to teach me a lesson. Look at these guys over here. What level are you? Oh, you're not too bad. Alright, good, good, good. Level 5, I can handle level 5. Yeah, I think I gotta kill the level 15 guy for these guys to stop spawning. But I'm running out of ammo very quickly and I don't have time to use the big... The big crossbow over there. Crap. 
Ah. Oh, I'm so screwed. Come on, come on, come on. We can recover. We can recover. We can recover. Come on, come on. Just need some. Just need some distance. There we go. Yeah, this. Uh, this. This is. Uh, I can, I can see where you're going with the ancient emulator comparison, but it feels and plays nothing like it. Um, this has loot, this has uh, upgrades, this has, I mean, pretty much everything you would want in a game like this. Um, and it's intense, man. It's really, really intense. It's very difficult, uh, and, it, and it didn't take long to get difficult. Uh, Sleeve, this is a total should we, man. Uh, this is 15 bucks. This is a really fun game. It looks nice. It plays great. Uh, I love it. Uh, yeah, Ronnie, uh, I th I'm pretty sure that Alchemy just, didn't they, did they not just tweet something about Vacation Simulator? I'm pretty sure they did. Um, it's got to be coming soon. I'm, I'm not excited about Vacation Simulator. Like, I didn't, I didn't love, love, love Job Simulator the way everyone else did. Like, I really enjoyed it, but like, everyone else like, oh, it's my favorite game. It's one of the top ten best PSVR games. I'm like, uh, I don't know. Okay, so they're just reminding people that it's coming, I guess. Um, I, I would say, I would say, within the next couple months. Yeah, it's like, it, like what it had going for it was was a good sense of humor, and uh, and I'm very seldom in the mood for uh, for just like I'm gonna go play something funny. So I, I have no idea how long this game is. Uh, using move controllers. Uh, Actually, uh, I don't, don't think this supports the DualShock 4, but if anyone else can back me up on that. There we go. Uh, so I have no idea how long this is because it, uh, because it's just, I'm just, we just got started. I think we've only been playing for about an hour. 35 levels, holy crap. If it's 35 levels, like, this could easily take, like, 10 hours or more to beat. We're definitely t and we're definitely taking our time. Uh, Chaz, it's kind of the opposite of what you'd expect. Like it's kind of the opposite of Skyrim. So, on on your right hand, on your right move controller, uh, is where is where you're holding the move button down to to kind of decide where you're going. Uh, and then it's and then it's the face buttons below that on the right move controller. I want to say circle and X. And those turn you left and right. There's, tele there's, there's an option for teleportation. There is uh, an option for click turning. But as always, I turned all those things off as soon as possible. 35 levels of steady difficulty curve. They haven't met me. This, this is not steady. This is this, this ramped up very, very quickly. Um, yeah, the controls took a while to get used to, for sure. Like, it's probably the first half hour I was playing. Uh, but now, second nature, for sure. Um, so, so if you, if you start playing and you're like, ooh, this is, this, these controls are wonky, don't worry about it. You get used to it pretty fast. Oof. There we go, teleport it down. I like that. Yeah, 18 different weapons. That means we're going to be playing this game for a very, very long time. Because it's, what, what have I done, like three or four levels? And, uh... I haven't finished burning this shit? <laughs> there we go. Wow, can't wait for you to try this one. Alright, let's burn it, let's burn it, that's what we gotta do, we gotta burn it. There we go. You're getting better at this, you know. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, we burned them all. Blue pillar of light? There that's it is. Our way back. All right. Good to have me around, isn't it? It's very good to have you around. Alright, so so fuck this guy. That's the thing. See, watch this. Let's see how. He is what? He's recovering health. Is this? Oh, is this even the same guy? He. Shit. I don't know, Chaz. Can you not hear the music? Uh, it's it's very very much drum focused music. Awesome, I think. The music is really really fitting, and it really drives the game forward. It's I'm really enjoying the music, to be honest with you. To, it, everything seems everything sounds so loud in the headset. Um, I can change it though if you guys want to hear. It. There, it's really good. There we go. Just doubled.
This isn't the, this isn't the same guy. Uh, PSVR 2 will be awesome because PSVR 1 is awesome. That's my stance on it. <laughs> PSVR is already awesome, so 2 can only be even better. All right, hey, wait, there was... Let's just replenish our, uh, our ammo slash arrows here. There we go, we're all good to go. Whoa. There you go. Sorry, I, I, didn't, I didn't realize how low the music was. Uh, it's 15 bucks on uh, on the U.S. store, in the North American store. So depending on where you are, um, what's up, Mako XL? How you doing, dude? Uh, it is time. It is time to go follow the blue light. Here we go, guys. We're moving. We're moving. It's not really that kind of game, dude. <laughs> My best trick will be uh, to, to not die. So, uh, so, so there you go. Yep, I always put that stuff in the description, Steve, uh, just in case anyone's from, anyone's curious. Uh, so if you don't know what, what what I'm playing on or what kind of controls I'm using, uh, I always make sure that I put that in the description. So, but to let you know, because I'm a nice guy, I'm playing on a PlayStation 4 Pro and using two move controllers, also using a PSVR headset. <laughs> That's uh, our stop. Now for the happy ending. Fire up the portal. The happy ending. I could definitely use a happy ending right about now. All right, do it. Let's charge in the portal. Here we go. Level seven, I can handle that. Yeah, no, no, definitely. If, if, if you are like a hardcore PSVR gamer, um, uh, no innuendo, Chaz. That's exactly what I meant. Uh, if you're a hardcore PSVR gamer, then by all means, you should already have a pro. No, 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 no! Alright, we're in trouble. Move, move. Excuse me. Uh, yeah, we need to keep moving. We need to keep moving. Alright, this is a spawn point. I don't want to be here. Come on, move, move. Holy crap. Alright. <laughs> Alright, come on, come on. Okay. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, portal's open, we're going. Excellent work. You were talking progress. Alright, yeah, we're gonna, we, we'll leave that about there. I, I gotta turn the volume in the headset down because it's, it's even though it's uh, not terribly loud for you guys, it's pretty loud for me. All right, there we go. Much better, much better. All right, so let's see. We can uh, let's check our upgrades. Uh, except we want to make sure we upgrade the weapons we want to upgrade. So we have our ranged attack. I'm loving. The dual crossbows, or if you want to call them a crossfire. Um, so bolt speed. Oh, we definitely want to improve the damage. Like, more than anything, we just want to keep improving the damage. Right? Bolt speed? I guess, right? Yeah, Kevin, are you... I, I mean, are you trying to get... Are you trying to get kicked, or what? <laughs> Alright. Let's see here, let's see. What do we got going on? Uh, these swords are great, man, but, uh... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Let's 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 just get into another level here. I'm trying to complain, but you could bring me something back sometime. All right, so we've done all the blue ones. We haven't done Cruel Canyon or Westward Ascent. Uh, let's see the difficulty here in Cruel Canyon. Difficulty brave, so the same as last time. Here, you know what? Let's just take a little. Uh, let's take a little. Well, you do it any other way. Like how difficult do these things get? Alright, we can't check out the other ones. So I don't I don't know how many difficulty levels there are. Remember, keep your elbows close if you're attached to them. Alright, we'll just we'll knock these out one by one. We'll take care of all the brave ones first. Um, 
I'm going to keep the same weapons because I do not... Because once I start upgrading weapons, man, I want to use the upgraded weapons. Let's do this thing. Somewhere in these lands, an old library is hidden. It houses ancient scrolls that describe rituals orcs use to create their portals. I guess some things better be forgotten. Ronnie, you don't, uh, you don't keep up with the channel very much, huh? Um, so Michelle is, uh, Michelle is, she's doing her thing, man. She's, uh, she's got a kid, and a fiancé, and a real job. Uh, and so basically, she's, and she's going back to school, man. She's in, she's in, uh, she's taking some college classes. So, basically that doesn't give her any time to play VR games, or any games at all. And it definitely doesn't give her time to come hang out with us and talk video games. So, uh, unfortunately, Michelle, um... She backed out of the channel, but she is always welcome here uh, whenever she wants. She was on She was on a very recent episode of The Litter Box Be just last week. Um, Get lonely, yeah? So if you do want to see her, just hit us up with a dollar or more a month on patreon.com slash withoutparolegames. It looks, like it looks like I can parry with these things, so that's pretty awesome. I didn't, I didn't. I thought I was gonna be screwed without a shield, but I think I. I think I am actually parrying. So, that's cool. I'm curious to know how different these levels get. Uh, yeah, we all miss Michelle, man. Um. <laughs> awesome. I'm glad to hear it, man. For sure. Uh, it's. It, it, it's. It's. It's crazy that we have like people who watch everything we do, uh, and, it, and it means a lot to us for sure. Uh, I'm curious to know how different these levels get. Like, so, whoa, whoa, whoa! What in the hell? Who cast that? Oh, hey guys! Do, 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 do. This isn't a problem at all. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. All right. No, I don't like this thing here. Can you go away, please? Go away. Okay. Thank you. Yes. All right. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Um. I, I am excited for Siren. I'm, I'm cautiously excited for Siren. Um, I, you know, a lot, a lot of people have been saying, um, I saw on Reddit, they're like, there's been no news of Siren, there's been no news of Siren. Um, and I'm like, fucking, doesn't anyone pay attention? <laughs> like, I've been updating people on Siren, like, as often as possible um, for so long, because I have been excited uh, for it, so I've, I've been in touch with Hammerhead pretty regularly. Uh, <laughs> Take it easy, Steve. They're going to be terrified of you. Uh, but what I'm, what I'm most excited about is that we don't have to wait for episode two. We get episode one and two. Hopefully, it's not more than twenty bucks. Um, and, ho and hopefully, it's. What do hide in chests anyway? Hopefully, it's improved over the PC version. I don't think it's a very long game, but we'll we'll see. Okay. Here it is. Whoa. Uh, <laughs> there you go. All right. Whoa, whoa. Okay, just hanging out over here. Oh, They're gonna use range attacks. I think we'll use range attacks. Man, word of my big head has spread to lands near and far. Holy crap, I've got all these arrows inside me. <laughs> can, you, can you not? Thank you. All right, good. <laughs> They're not very active. I like how everything ricochets. I'm just going to waste the crap out of these arrows, because there's a, a thin back here I can just go replenish. All right. Okay, let's go, let's go replenish our stock. So we're down to like 11. I think we need more than 11 to beat this level. Just 
There it is, all the way up here, man. All the way back from whence we came. And we're all stocked up. Alright, cool. Let's do this. go. This is where we just were. Make sure we don't miss anything before we grab that chest over there. I love the, I just love the floating rocks. Like, I guess the whole thing plays out on a floating rock, but they really add something. Okay, so we'll do that. Wow, can't wait for you to try this one. Alright, here we go. Oh. Heads up, we have a skyship incoming. Skyship incoming. There's the skyship. That is very cool. Here we go. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep our distance. Maybe, just... Do some ranged attacks here. Range attacks are not working as well as I want them to. I also have terrible aim. Thanks, man. I don't, I don't think any of the VO that's in there is final. Uh, I, I told Reggie like that. Uh, I'm very, I'm, I'm like, you know, I'm honored that he asked me to do it. Um, but I'm no, I'm no voiceover guy. Like I've never really done stuff like that before. So I think everything that we've done like so far is temporary. To hide a treasure nearby. All kind of experimenting at this point, seeing what works and seeing what doesn't. Um, so, oh, 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 hey. There we go. Alright, I don't think there wasn't any quest, right? Oh, there hey, was is there a chest? I'm pretty sure I just saw a chest. Right there, in front of you. Thunder, what do we have here? Scroll fireball. You know what? I don't think we've. Oh, Neat! Why don't you shove it into an orc's face and see what it does? <laughs> uh, let's check our quest. Find the old library. Okay, I guess we uh, need to go look at that blue light. Hey, there's a light. Let's go find the blue light. Ooh, it's really far down there. Uh, I definitely really need to start paying attention when I'm running around. Because I just kind of go wherever. But obviously there's a light. 
to follow. Here it is. Right. I can tell already this is gonna be this is gonna be some bad news here, I can tell. These old books describe spells and rituals orcs use to create their portals. I guess some things better be forgotten. Find something to burn them. Wow! Can't wait for you to try this one. Strategy here. I'll have your spine. I can smell your fear from here. Let me teach you. Haste now. I wonder how you're going to use that. Something epic, I hope. Whoa, whoa, come on, Gordon. <laughs> move, move, move. <laughs> Jesus, it's hard to avoid this. Uh, Jesus. That's getting worse. Come on, come on. Oh shit, I don't have a... Mm -hmm. I wanted to give up. Level 14! Bad news. Alright. Five. Five. Keep moving. <laughs> What's up, Wolfie Smith? How you doing, dude? Now there should be a way back in your mind. Look for an ugly arch with a blue light on it. Alright, looks like we burned everything we needed. There we go. So even though we can't kill the level 14 guy, I'm mean, not with any. I mean, not with any effectiveness. I could totally just try to keep going for it, man. But I think ultimately. That's the portal right there. Let's see if we can fire it up. I don't know if it's better to run and just complete the level, or if it's uh. We should actually be killing everything in sight. I mean, I'd love to kill everything in sight, but we're not that strong. And get these guys as they spawn in. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, paranormal activity will get to you. I'm actually really enjoying this. Yes, now quickly through the portal. All right, except we gotta, we gotta get through the portal. Here we go. Here we go. And we're going. <laughs> Sweet. Marvelous. For all we know, we could have both been orcs in the past life. Book of Force. Let's check it out. All right, let's take a look at our bubble tree here. Book of Force conjures a shockwave dealing 30 damage to all enemies within 4 meters in front of you. 10 second cooldown. Ooh, I like that. We're only level 1. How, how do we get to level 2?
how the Book of Force is level 1. Okay. Uh, Wolfie, this this has been out for a while uh, in the U.S. Um, doesn't seem to be out everywhere, um, but it's been out for like I think a month here in the states, uh, and I'm just now getting around to it. Uh, it's been sitting on my hard drive for way too long. Right, I'm, gonna say, I'm gonna say we want to keep upgrading our crossfire, although man, that last. The last time we tried to use it, it was not not doing what I wanted it to do. It was not strong enough at all. So let's upgrade these. Yeah, Jay, I wasn't planning on it. This was, I was just going to stream this for a few hours tonight, and then uh, and that was going to be it. Uh, but I think it's it's so much better than I anticipated that I'm going to I'm going to keep playing it. Um, you know, and if I'm going to spend a lot of time with it, then I, then I should definitely review it. All right. Remember, keep your elbows close if you're attached to them. Now let's take care of Westward Ascent, and then I think that'll be... Well, that won't be everything on here. Nope, Westward Ascent. There we go. Still brave difficulty, which is good, I guess. Yeah, I do feel I do feel like as we get closer to Halloween, I'm gonna have to switch over to like streaming some really scary stuff. The problem is I've already I've already played it all, um, and so watching me get scared is not nearly as exciting. What's up, Chris? Of your game cat? What's happening, dude? All right, let's do Westward Ascent. I'm curious to know if these levels are going to start looking different once we get to some of the other ones. Uh, but, for now... I mean, Jay, it's... Black Iron Forges work mercilessly to outfit the Lord with impervious armor. It's time to fight fire with fire force. Jay, I'd love to, uh, I'd love to stream Resident Evil 7. Uh, I don't think I've played it since the, uh, since the infinite ammo run that I tried to do. Uh, that was a total failure. I really thought I was gonna like get through half the game or so uh, in just a few hours. But holy crap, man! That that was way harder than I anticipated. But uh, I'm t I'm totally down to spend more time with it. Resident Evil 7 is probably my favorite game of like all time, uh, at least in VR. So so why not, man? Why not? Maybe as we get closer to Halloween. When in doubt, aim for the head. firewall last night for a little bit just to check out the graphical improvements and uh, first of all blown away by how nice it looks um, target practice is here but I really didn't I didn't have time to just like sit and play or stand and play um, it was it was fun to drop in and play more uh, I really really miss it come back from this Here we go. Much better. Much better. Yeah, Jay, I'm totally down to play Firewall. Um, not tonight, because I gotta get ready for the PSVR this week. Um, Look up! Target practice is here. But definitely soon. Definitely soon. I've been. I've been. I've been skipping out on Firewall far too often. I'm, I'm, I'm at such a low level, man. I, I still don't I still don't have signal jammers. I'm so far behind everyone else at this point. Um, oh. 
for the need. Like there's a little part of me that actually is is, uh, is terrified to go back in the firewall, knowing that everyone else has been playing it pretty much nonstop. Uh, so I, I feel like I'm not even gonna have I'm gonna have a chance at survival. Yeah, <laughs> um, I didn't. I actually didn't see that that stream until this morning. Uh, I was feeling a little bit left out, but at the same time, I was like crazy busy and stuff. So Neat. I'll try not to feel too much. Yeah, this this is really fun. It's also really difficult, uh, which is why I'm really taking my time. If I can say really a few more times. <laughs> It, it is fairly mindless action, um, but only in the sense of like that like Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance was mindless action. This is like kind of the perfect VR version of that. Man, Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance back on like the PS2 was so much fun. I love that game. So we'll follow the blue light, huh? I like that they're slowly mixing in like some new architecture here. It's like this old cathedral is just like totally in ruins. It's kinda nice. I'm pretty sure orcs have hidden. But that's the Iron Forge. Keep your wits about you. The Forge Master must be around. Keep your distance and wait for an opening in his defenses. Whoa, this is gonna be tough, huh? Wait for an opening in his defenses? What's the opening? Oh, there's the opening. Jesus, this is going to be impossible. Yeah, I really hope Impulse Gear is working on uh, Farpoint 2. Um, I really want some jetpacks. Switch weapons, these are not doing me much good. Jesus, move, move, move. Alright. Seven. Come on, come on, come on. Even seven on top right now. There go. Good. We're still alive. <laughs> hey, welcome back, Will. <laughs> yeah, I'm loving it, man. I'm absolutely loving it. Hey, Skippy. How are you doing, dude? Um, I don't. I don't. I don't know. I don't know what level I'm up to. I don't know anything. I play games, I, when I first start playing games, I'm like so blind. I'm like, I, I don't pay attention to anything that's important. And then like three hours in, I'm like, oh, I should've been paying attention to all that stuff. All right, what's, where's the, there's the blue light. All right, we're gonna go find the blue light. Has Jeremy tried firewall yet? That's looking more unlikely by the day, but we'll see, we'll see. Damn, he's not going down easy. Ooh, there's Up there, a skyship. Skyship's coming.
Let's go ahead and get a little distance. Everything's fine if you can get away. Just heal up real quick. Man, the heat of things, though. It's pretty crazy. Destroy him! Hey, hey, hey. Oh, oh, hey, I guess we gotta try this out here. That's pretty cool. No, I definitely want to the meteor, holding the shield there. We got all sorts of stuff floating around this. Alright, so now we have a book and a scroll. Alright, we'll leave that one there. Head on over here. Alright, where's Big Scary Dude? Definitely want to stay away from Scary Dude. Uh, Mama Cat's doing good. Uh, she's acing all of her college classes. She is. Uh, she, Aiden is awesome. Totally happy, healthy baby boy. Um, and uh, she gets to spend a lot of time with him with her uh, with a new job. I endorse that statement thoroughly, Chris. Thank you. Two first names. Oh, oh, me. Hey, what's going on? I was like, who has two first names? And I guess that's me. I'm doing pretty good. Thanks for asking. How are you doing? All right, where's that blue light again? I keep keep getting distracted by stuff. Ooh, this guy's alive. Whoop. Oh, no. No, no, no. Get out of here. Cheating, but I'm okay with cheating. <laughs> I was just inside the shield, slain away at her. Uh, what is her new job? She's a she's a she's a teacher of some kind, like early childhood stuff. Um, but she wants to do like. Ah ah ah! Jesus, can't get away from those. I guess I should probably just duck, right? Kind of like an actual duck. Under the fire, the stone cracks. Crap, trying to get away. Ah, it's too close. Under the fire, the stone cracks. Come on, come on. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Whew. That's right. Whew. That was tough. Look for an with a blue light above it. That's the way back. Hurry up to it. Alright. Back to the blue light. It always comes back to the blue light. Yeah, so anyway, uh, long story short, Michelle's doing great. Um, she's very happy. She doesn't have time for video games uh, or much of anything anymore, but she's very, very happy. She's an amazing, responsible mother. And uh, if anybody ever saw old episodes of uh, the Games Cast, you'll know that Michelle and responsibility, uh, along with Brian Paul and responsibility, were not always a thing. That's the portal um, right there. Let's see if we can fire it up. So, in other words, we couldn't be happier for her. She's doing, she's doing awesome. Now, unfortunately, Smash It Plunder is one of those games that I, I'm, I did the Let's Play, and that's going to be the extent of it. Um, I don't, I don't, I'm not able to really do much local co-op here, uh, so I don't have time for that, and, uh, and so I don't, don't feel like I can give it a fair review. <laughs> What's the sprint vector technique, Will? Is it just running away? Or just waving my arms as fast as possible. <laughs> There's so many bad guys here. Whoa. Whoa. There's a lot of bad guys. Yep, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> Swiping away. Slash, slash, slash. I will absolutely let her know that you guys are asking about her. Uh, Welcome, don't you think? The portal is ready. 
I think the most overpriced VR game might actually be Heavy Fire, Red Shadow. Don't you think? Oh, Jesus. Holy crap, these guys get to the portal. The portal is ready! Alright, we're going. Ah, there we go. Move, move, move. We're going to the portal. Screw everybody. Ah, right, there we They're go. They're going to be terrified. That shows them. Robinson the Journey. You think now, you think Robinson the Journey is the most story, overpriced? I think Robinson is slightly overpriced for what it is. Um, and I think everyone thinks it's overpriced because it never goes on sale. Arc Park is a good contender, but I really think Heavy Fire Red Shadow for 30 bucks, I, as far as what you actually get uh, based on, and, and compared to the amount you spend, I'm going to say Heavy Fire is most uh, overpriced game. Uh, as far as most underpriced game, I might have to go with Two to the Top. I think that's an excellent choice. Uh, underpriced? <laughs> Even though Skyrim's usually full price, I might have to go with that. Because there's so much... You can spend like 300 hours in Skyrim. And so like, it doesn't matter how much you pay for that game. It is... It, you get so much more than you pay. Yeah, hey, David Seegerson, my, L my LRG buddy. God Cannon hanging out. Summer Lesson is pretty pricey, um, although digitally you can still get it. Uh, I think when you start talking about physical copies just because of rarity, then like then you start talking about like Job Simulator. That's like way too much money. Like, like 300 bucks for Job Simulator uh, physical copy. You could totally live in Skyrim. See, that's what I'm saying. It's a great deal. <laughs> nice. All right. All right, guys, here we are. It is time to go back into the world. Let's check out the Highlands. Oh, you're going to love this. Do we want to go to Jewel's End? Oh, difficulty legendary. Oh, I don't know how I feel about this. Hold on a second. Oh, I didn't realize that these... Hit, hit, hit. So much choice! These are actually selecting different parts of this map. Alright, alright, here we go. So we're gonna, we're gonna move away from the highlands and head on over to, uh, whatever this is. Let's check it out. Orcish repeater ballistas have grown quite a grim reputation in the broken lands. Able to hurl piercing bolts over many miles, it weakens the opponent before the actual attack even begins. Your task is simple. Use the fiery rune to blow up the repeater nest. I'm gonna use the fiery rune. Fiery boon! Ba -da -ba -ba. Um... Yo, yo God Cannon, how, how much of this game did you complete? I want Fire One projectiles. I'm pretty sure orcs have hidden a chest nearby. Wanna check it out? Remember, oh, tactical no. retreat is always a sound option. <laughs> 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 Yeah, Job Simulator, I get Job Simulator like on a launch day for like 20 bucks. Um, and when I found out that it was like super expensive, I was like, uh, Dez, I need my copy of Job Simulator back. <laughs> this will definitely come in handy. Arrow sticking out of me. Walk down! Alright, cool, cool. So, I mean, I gotta say, I mean, I obviously expected the world to be pretty similar, you know, like floating islands, stone and stuff in the sky. Um, but it's, but it's, it's awesome just to get a, a little variety here. It's strange that the snow is following my vision. I don't know if you guys can see that in the headset. Uh, it's obviously they're trying to make, they're trying to do some graphical trick to make it look like it's snowing, but really it's just a layer on top of the environment. 
Wolfie Smith, have an awesome night, dude. Thanks for hanging out and stopping in. Uh, yeah, oh, man, that snow's going to mess with my head. All right, all good, though, all good. I'm gl I'd rather have it be there and be wonky than not there at all. All right, let's go, uh... Let's go deliver our skull. This is not multiplayer. Uh, on, on PC it was multiplayer, but here on PlayStation VR it launched with only single player. Um, we don't know if we're actually getting multiplayer. We are hoping so, but I don't think I don't think we've gotten any confirmation. We've all just got our fingers crossed, if nothing else. Super Amaze Balls for five bucks is pretty under. Hey, where's the blue light? Oh, it's going the wrong way. Let's go follow the blue light. David, I think the only limited run games game that I need that like I want, I, I've stopped buying Watch everything. Get close to those uh, ballistas. Orcs would not leave their toys unguarded for long. Thanks, Shaolin, for the five dollar donation. You are awesome. I really, really appreciate it. What's up, Planet Real Gaming? How you doing? Whoa! This is gonna be really, really difficult. Okay. Right, this is in trouble here. So I'm getting a little more particular with the limited run games that I'm buying. Uh, there we go. Alright. Man, you just stopped in. What, what is what is with the, the planet sim the planet simulator? God damn it. I can't think and play at the same time. What what is what's what's why is everyone talking about vacation simulator all the time? It's like obviously coming out really soon, but like very interesting. Now, like everyone's thinking about it all at the same time. I must have missed something. Scroll the show. We're gonna leave that there. Hey, buddy. Die, die, die. Yeah, I think uh, I, I, I think as I think as far as uh, limited run games go, Wanna go I'm, treasure hunting? For, for me at There's this point, no it's, right it's just just Switch games and just Vita games. Uh, I am. I'm, I'm trying to collect. There's a little part of me that wants to get every Vita game ever made, uh, just because I'm like kind of like. 60 70 percent of the way there already thank you real planet real gaming i appreciate that uh chris Vick, thank you for stopping in dude i can have an awesome night um i'm just not i, I just I, I don't know like i think the older i get and the less room that i have in my apartment the less like collecting is interesting me um <clears throat> at this point like a, a game comes in from limited run or, or or like a new psvr retail copy of something and I, and I go, oh, this is so cool, I have it. And then I take it and I put it on top of a pile. And I'm like, huh. Like, that, it's not very satisfying to add it to the collection when it's just like, all right, the new game sits on top of a pile. So I, I got to start making some serious decisions about, um, about, <clears throat> about what I'm collecting and how much I'm collecting for it. Um, I feel like I could sell a good, a good portion of my <laughs> PS4 games and not even, not even care. All right. Here, we gotta, we gotta get used to using these things here. Alright, hold it to aim. And then you let go to fire. It's, it's, it's easy to to operate, but, but I haven't actually taken anyone down with it. <clears throat> You'll take my gun con too? Well, you can take one of them. I have about seven, I think, since I... Oh, we gotta defend it. Crap. What's up, Game Catechus? Oh, crap, crap, crap. Oh, no, I'm on the wrong side of this thing. Okay. So I, I have the big boxes. For Gun Con 2 games, I have the big boxes of, like, all of the PS2 ones. Crap, that was unexpected. 
Yeah. So, I, so I don't know how many gun con twos I actually have, but uh, but it's quite a few. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. All right, everything's fine, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Don't worry, Brian, everything's great. <laughs> I want one of those, uh, I want one of those, those, uh, those orange. All those orange beaters from Japan, man. Those things are so cool. Are the ice blue ones? I've got my own tricks to show Oh no! Oh, come on! I think. <laughs> oh crap! This isn't going well. <laughs> I don't. I don't actually know what my Halloween plans are at the moment uh, in terms of like the channel. That was pretty good, actually. We'll see. I, I got to talk to Jeremy. I know Jeremy I wants to do a home sweet home. Blue light. You won't miss it. You? Where's the blue light? Where's the blue light? Uh, so we'll we'll see if he's down to do that. I don't know if he's gonna do that before or after or during or whatever. Um, but we'll we'll figure it out. We still got a few days to figure out Halloween plans. And the PSP God of Wars, those got those got HD remakes, didn't they? Like over on the PS3, like in a in a bundle or something. Like in that Ultimate God of War collection, there's like five games in there. It's like both of the PSP ones, um, both of the PS2 ones. What am I forgetting? <laughs> there's something else in there. Is it, is it God of War 3? You found know. it! Look for the control room and give it a little tap. Alright, we tap, tap, tap. <laughs> Man, I, I, <laughs> I feel like I feel like David Seagerson and I would get along really good. <laughs> like I say, I love my Dreamcast collection, but I think my Dreamcast collection is my second favorite after my Turbo Graphics. Turbo Graphics, PC Engine, that is like my favorite of like the 8 and 16 bit generation for sure. It's just like so obscure. Half people don't even know shit about it. Move, gonna move, gonna move. <laughs> Obviously, my strategy here. Dive, run in. I'm telling him about to die. I, I, Jay, I think I have a Patreon video. What's up, Joe Monahan? Our way out is here. Jump into the portal quickly. I have, I have an old litter box episode about about the rest oh, of my know. apartment. Could have both been orcs in the past um, life. It's uh, I'm kind of kind of like curious how old it is now, how accurate it is. Searching wand, no scorching wand. Scorching wand is way cooler than a searching wand. I want it. Throw. Oh, like throw. Ooh. 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 I just like this thing. Ooh. <laughs> God of War VR with the Oh wait, I got a book over here. Oh. Okay, I'm not exactly sure what that does, but I'm fucking thrilled about it. Nice. Alright. Uh, yeah. God. What are they called? The Chains of Olympus? Is that what it is? Uh, that'd be amazing to 
use the move controllers and attack that way in VR. Chains of Olympus? Why does that not sound right? The Blades of Olympus. Blades, right? Chains? Fuck me, I haven't played God of War in forever. Actually, I, I didn't even play the new God of War. Um, I don't know if I will either, we'll see. Alright, where are we up to? We just did Hill of Wind. Actually, you know what? Let's let's see if we can explore some other worlds here. New choice this time. Don't be boring. Chains of Chaos. What, what is what is the, the Olympus part? Oh, Chains of Olympus. Uh, man, I don't know anything. Ridge of Curiosities. Ridge of Curiosity sounds fun. I'm I'm curious, like a cat. We're heading out to the ridge. Let's go. Oh. Hold on a second. <laughs> uh, let's do the melee attack. This seem, these seem to be helping me more than anything, so let's keep leveling these up. <laughs> What's up, Gary? And Sonya. Williams. Oh, no frills. This is definitely a should we. This is a uh, very, very positive on this game. Big time. Uh, I want more horror VR games. I'm actually sad that the season is ending because I'm scared that, like, most developers aren't going to release their scary games, like, after you this month. The Peter Ballistas have grown quite a grim reputation in the Broken Lands. People to hurl piercing bolts over many miles, it weakens the opponent before the actual attack even begins. Your task is simple. Use the fiery room to blow up the repeater nest. My favorite game series. tough question. Uh, I mean, I think it might be Resident Evil, but there's a huge, gigantic fucking asterisk after Resident Evil, um, where, where I say, I liked, I loved 1, 2, 3, I, I kind of liked 4, I hated 5 and 6, uh, and then 7 was amazing. And then, like, all the side spin-offs and stuff, like Outbreak, I played a little bit of that on PS2, um, the, survi the gun survivor game on PS2 with the gun con, since we were talking about it, that is awesome. Um, there were so many strange Resident Evil games. Um, hey, my cat, welcome back. I feel like I'm just going to be here all night. Everyone's coming and going. They come and then they go, and then they go and then they come. Watch out for the sky ships. They will try to ambush right. you with what a that? huge balloon. We've got, we got some variety going on here. I heard they call it the Master of Stealth. <laughs> I love DMC, except I only really like DMC 1. Um, or I like Devil May Cry 1. And then... Uh, and then that was kind of it. Like, DMC 2 was cool, and DMC 3 was kind of better than... Actually, 2 was horrible, wasn't it? 2 was the bad one. I hated Devil May Cry 2. Hey, I think I've seen a chest somewhere around uh, here. And the remake was, like, too scripted. I don't know. Yeah, I, I'm definitely sticking with one as my absolute favorite Devil May Cry game. Probably, space probably one. Whoa, hey. Probably one and then four. <laughs> Devil May Cry one and four, and I can probably do without the rest. I know everyone loves three. But, uh, yeah, I can't panic. Um. I don't know, three didn't do it for me. I think three was too hard. Ooh, Code Veronica. Code Veronica I absolutely love, for sure. If they make, if they ever made Dev Devil May Cry VR, I really, really hope what they do is remake the first game in VR, because my favorite enemies of all time were like those fucking possessed marionettes in the castle. Like that was just so cool, man. I loved that. Use this wisely. With great power comes irresponsibility. Oh, hey, I found the blue light. There it is. We're going that way. I think they should get the House of the Dead games while they're at it, man. Look up! Target practice is here! 
Oh, getting these guys from below is not going well. You can do it. Whoa, 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 hold on a second. Alright, alright, we're dead. We're dead. Not totally dead, but we are getting close to being dead. Oh yeah, Revelations was a good series. I think Revelations would be a great fit for VR. They could put that in the first person, no problem. Hey, what's going on here? Hey. <laughs> nice pet. Okay, keep moving. Uh, uh, get out, go! Welcome back, dude. Right, Pop? Watch out when you get close to those ballistas. I'm glad she went to bed. Do not leave their toys unguarded for long. Once the girls go to sleep, it's just the boys. Oof. Now I can't stop thinking about uh about Sprint Vector. And we'll get it in my head. That's that's what I'm actually playing here. Activate the fire rune. Alright, time to defend. Time to defend. Ben, Ben. What time is it? It's... All right, we've been going strong for at least two hours now. Here comes the airship. Be terrified of you. Ha 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 ha. Oh, it's not over. Crap. You're going down. Well, all is well. Come on, come on. Oh, where'd they go? They totally just disappeared. All right, all right, everything's cool. Still defending. Man, that is one long loading screen right there. Oh crap! Another airship. I'm ready for you. And I got a book. Look, I got a book. Hey, hey, hey! Where are you going? I have a book. Wait, where are you going? I have a book. Fabulous. That's all it does? <laughs> oh man, things are not going so good. No one cared that I had a book. <laughs> They're like, fuck your book. Yeah, it got way more intense. This, this game, the difficulty ramped up very, very quickly. Um, but it's all about, I think it, it just seems to be all about retreating. Knowing when you've had enough and then... Sort of how I play uh, Creed: Rise to Glory. I run in, I throw a few punches, and then I run out. The, the, I, I love the music. I, I love like the drum beats and stuff. It's, it's really... It's like this nice driving force that keeps you going. Uh, the, the audio, the, the enemy's audio, it's, it's kind of funny. And, uh, um, but it, it gets the job done. I mean, it's a $15 game. I'm not expecting a lot from it. Um, but it, and it's already given me more than I expected, to be honest with you. We're taking this guy down, I don't care. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. 
Oh, no, no, okay. Give us some space, give us some space. Gotta recoup. Recoup? Recoup our energy, I guess. Gotta recover. That's probably what I should be saying. Doom VFR. That was a good soundtrack. Very Doom like. Now, charge! Charge, cowards! Come on, come on, come on! Come on, there you go. Done for. Get all the gold. Where are we off to? Where are we off to? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where's the blue light? Hey, there's the blue light. Found you, blue light. Can't hide from me, blue light. That's our stop. Now for the happy ending. Fire at the portal. Yeah, I've said it like a million times. I'm such a huge fan of uh, Doom VFR with move controllers. I know that everybody hates it, uh, and it takes like hours to get used to that control scheme. But once you do, man, it is so much fun. Such a such a strategy game instead of a like a generic first-person shooter. Because that's kind of that's kind of like everyone's like, oh, I love Doom with the DualShock 4. I love Doom with the aim control. And I'm like, that's cool. Uh, only briefly, a game got it because I ended as fast as I began. I didn't know what I was doing. Um, like Doom, Doom is just so formulaic. It's so. It's so Doom. It's like it's it's just kind of like a boring Doom game. Not boring, but generic Doom game, which by nature is still pretty good. Uh, and then when you add, but then when we had the move controllers, you can tell it's just the way they meant for it to be played. What's up, Andrew? Oh uh, yeah, I'm getting my ass kicked, but other than that, everything's going good. It's actually a really, really fun game. I've lost count. We can move, we can move, here we go, portal's open. Ha <laughs> that's right. Run like the coward that was I am. pretty good, actually. They're even uglier from up close, aren't they? I'm a little curious to know I if they just get so angry all the time. If they just like endlessly spawn if I stick around. Uh, I'm not really sure. Like I don't want to find out because holy crap, I don't want to stick around that long. There we go. The sword's getting real powerful. I want to switch back to my my, my crossbows or whatever you call them, but they they really weren't that powerful. But I'm not using the book. <laughs> yeah, I agree with you, No Frills. Like, with the move controllers and the time and the slow time mechanic, it's all about like, it's all about being in front of the enemy, waiting for him to attack. And then slowing down time, jumping behind them, and then just like attacking the crap out of them. Uh, it's I don't know. I really, really like Doom with the move controllers. I think it's such a well thought out game. Nothing wrong with the DualShock 4 or the aim controller on that, but it's um, but for me, it's there's an obvious best way to play it, and no one else really agrees with me, uh, which which is fine. I'm, I'm actually getting used to that as the days go by. <laughs> All right, um, let's get, guys, it's getting later. It's, uh, it's getting real late, and I still have to do PSVR this week. So I'm going to do one more map, and then, uh, then I'm going to get out of here. Uh, so let's see if we can find some place we haven't been yet. I'm not trying to complain, but you could bring me something back sometime. I don't think we've been... Oh, oh, wait a minute. I didn't realize this is a... Like a wave attack section. Yeah, we'll do this, and then we'll do... And then we'll do an actual level. How about that? Defend the Guardian. What's up, Dead Ringer? Oh, 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 hey, look at the islands float up like that. Here they are, here they are. It's trippy to see up close. It's so cool. 
I really, really like that. That mechanic of these floating islands just moving around. <laughs> this is cool, man. Moved into it. <laughs> oh, now I don't trust myself. I keep moving into the arrows. Oh, got more. Seriously, Na Namco's gonna bring the Ridge Racer games or. Oh, hey. Or, uh. Or Criterion has to bring the Burnout games. Like, I don't even care if it's Burnout 1, man. Burnout 1 was, like, so. Amazing. Like obviously we'd all like Burnout Paradise or something like that, but I'll pick one at a time. <laughs> Holy crap. I was way too close to that. It felt really strange. What happens if I'm on the islands when they float away? Is that a possibility? Oh, they don't let me on the island. Okay, well that explains everything. Twisted Metal Black in VR. Black was always my favorite one. Destroy him. Let's see what you got. Jet Moto. Ooh. Looks like I'm out of uh, I'm out of ammo. I've got my own tricks. Fuck you. I got as much ammo as I need right here. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Time to some melee attack going. Nice. Ah, so weird. Wave four. I wonder. This good. This eventually has to be waves where. They just come from all directions, right? It's like a Bukaki of Orcs. Has to be a thing. guy's not gonna move so we have to do some range attacks here. right there. Oh, oh where'd these guys come from? Oh. I wanted to give a lecture about what makes level eight? I think we can handle level eight. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, it's too close to the edge. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah! Uh, wave five. Wave five. Why do I feel like it should be like wave a thousand? I 
feel like we're pretty lucky to, to get even what we've gotten so far this generation. Like, we, we have a pretty stellar PlayStation VR lineup. Um, I'm excited about Beat Saber because you know it should be fun, but like I think I think everyone's so excited about Beat Saber. I'm like I don't I don't think I get the excitement, but you know whatever works. I'm glad people are excited about PS4 games. But you know what, I'm, I'm, I, I feel like when outside of the the typical like Resident Evil 7 kind of like, you know, big experience or like, or even like the persistence, I was excited to die. But like, I wasn't excited, I wasn't excited for Firewall. Um, and like, if I knew how great Firewall was going to be or how, how addictive it would be and how much fun I'd have with it, um, then, like, I, I would have been way more excited about it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bad news, Bear is here. Think that uh, I think that Beat Saber will be great. It's just that I'm not excited for it because I haven't played it yet. You know, I, I see the I see the footage of it. And I'm like, wow, that looks really difficult, and I'm excited to give it a shot. Um, but I'm not like, but until I get my hands on it, until I get inside of Beat Saber, uh, I probably won't be excited about it. And then once I start playing, I'll probably fucking fall in love with it because that's how every other game is working. Guardian's not doing so well. Here they come. Alright, let's get over here. Yeah, Thumper is pretty awesome. I love Thumper. What's up, MTM the Game Cat? Somebody should hashtag Game Cat you. I feel like maybe you've never gotten a shout out for that. <laughs> I wish I could go onto these islands and go attack him, but I'd have to wait for him to come to me or use ranged attacks. But I get it, when the island starts to float away, what are they going to do with me? There we go. Covering any health? It doesn't look like it. Looks like he's just. That's his. That's the best we got. Oh, dude, I'm. I'm. I'm actually very excited for Borderlands because I never played it. Um, 
You know, it's like, I wish it was the full game, I wish it was DLC, I wish it was multiplayer, but like, you know, I think, I think we're very, very fortunate to get what we get right now. So I'm not going to complain. And it's, it'll be my first real venture into that world, so. So for me, it's going to be like all new, you know, it's like, the, the first time I ever played Skyrim was in VR. And so like, I was like, I didn't miss mods, I didn't even, you know, I didn't even know what I was missing. So with Borderlands 2, it's going to be the same exact thing. Definitely not going to know what I'm missing. Yeah, who made who made a little Big Planet three? That was Sumo Digital, right? And then the last we heard, they were working on uh, uh, Dead Island two. And Dead Island two is like MIA completely at this point. It's like I don't even know if that game's still in development. And then did did Sumo get the? Is Sumo still working on that game, or did they get moved to something else? Yeah, it was Sumo. Okay, cool. I can't lie, I'm, I'm ready for this to be over. <laughs> I've had enough. I've had enough wave shooting. <laughs> I, I like the adventure segments of this more than the... Uh, than, than this one. At least it's wave 10. We're doing alright. Uh, oh, there's more. Okay, never ending this. There we go. Right. Yeah, I think Silent Hill 2 in first person would be incredible in VR. Alien Isolation would be incredible. That game scared the crap out of me on a flat screen, so... Okie dokie. I think I'm... really want to, want to be done with... Weave game. There we go. That's it. I'm just tired. <laughs> I'm tired, I'm hungry, I am ready to, uh, I'm ready to be done with Trickster VR for the night. Uh, so I think that's gonna do it, guys. Thanks, thanks for. Uh, my, I, I did not expect my first impression. Zalan Maru, what's up, dude? I think. Uh, <laughs> I think this this turned out to be a much much better game uh, than than I was expecting. So I'm really really happy with Trickster VR. Uh, this is a definite. Should we? Oh, look at the birds. Oh, look at, look at the birds. All right. Uh, yeah, guys. Thanks thanks for hanging out for so long. I know a lot of you guys were here for like. A new challenge every day. Like the whole time. Like to make this jump, right? So, all right, guys. Uh, I'm, I'm off to I'm off to prep PSVR this week for tomorrow. Uh, you guys have an awesome, awesome night, and uh, everybody enjoy playing Firewall with God Cannon. Uh, I love you all. MTM the Game Cat. Hashtag Game Cat, man. We got to give you a shout out on Viewer Takeover. Love you guys. Good night.